kids are playing around at the park in Bishop while Jason went across the street to Schott's Bakery to uh, get us our second breakfast in the morning since we woke up at like 4.30 this morning for the drive. So we're excited to get shots. It's like got amazing bakery stuff, whether it's pull apart or cheese bread or whatever. And then we're gonna hit the trails. Oh. Here we go. Hold on. So we just started our hike. We're in Little Lakes Valley up in the Eastern Sierras. And this goes to a whole bunch of lakes in the area. And I think we're staying two nights, three nights. It's a little bit up for debate, but um, we're excited to check out all the lakes that are here. Miles has his fishing pole. So we'll see. I think depending on how much we hike around the lakes, we might go four miles today. I'm not sure. I'll let you know. We got a river going through our trail. Walk on the side, guys. This is, I think, maybe the third or fourth lake we've come up to. This one's prettier than the other lakes earlier. This is Box Lake. Okay, revision. Actually, this lake is Heart Lake. Uh, I don't know if you can see. You can't tell from the video. It is kind of shaped like a heart, though. We are Ani. Show me, which lake are we at? Box Lake. You had a, diff a little, um, show me your, your box. Uh. <laughs> We're at Box Lake. Yep, if you don't If you don't look up, you would almost even miss it cuz this was like right at like our level. So the word is this is Long Lake. Stick or a dead fish? I can't see it. It's probably oh, can I see 
trying to figure out that thing floating out there is. Bonnie's holding the gummy bears for us. Yum. And Archie over here sat down on the log with his pack and went <laughs> completely backwards, huh? The, the weight of the, ooh. And there were a lot of tears. We have some battle wounds. The weight of the pack you haven't figured out yet. You're a tough cookie. Yeah, we'll All right, we are at Chicken Foot Lake. A little bit of patches of snow. We saw lots of fish in the stream. Hello? 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 Why? Archie! Well, you lasted longer than your brother thought. He said five seconds. No, hold on. He's like up to here. Up to where? Here. <laughs> Are you going to show us how it's done, Miles? Hey, look. I can We've got I can some clouds coming in. We're hoping they are not rain clouds. It's raining. It's always a little scary when you see clouds Mom, in the you Sierras. Be take oh. Mom. Mom. Yep, What's that it? looks comfortable. Three, two. <laughs> Look at her face. She's freezing. No, then why don't you stay in there? No, I know. It's actually better than just standing. What is? Bonnie, full body for 15 seconds. Do you want me to? <laughs> yeah. What do you want me to do? Put your full body in for 15 seconds. Like my head too? No, yeah. just like up to here. Up to your shoulders is what he's saying. One, two, three, <laughs> She can barely breathe. Four. How is it, Charlotte? What? How is that? It's cold. <laughs> over where we were sitting a couple spot. minutes ago. The water is so clear. Chicken Foot Lake, right? Can that be Chicken Chicken Foot Lake? Sure. Since you're out blue stones in the water. Yeah. Baby fishies! You guys seen fish in there?
Miles, how many fish have you caught today? Zero. So far. But we've seen them. We've seen them swimming. So Miles is in his underwear trying to go get a hook out of the river because he was fishing in this itty bitty stream that has tons of fish swimming around. So now he has to go get the hook out. It's pretty funny. All right, trying to figure out what this old piece of equipment is. Any guesses? Anybody? Don't know. We're heading over to the Jim Lakes, which is past Chicken Foot Lake. Rock hopping. So it took us a while to find this spot because we were walking all around the lake trying to get spots closer to the lake. And because we got here at, uh, I don't know, four something maybe, um, there are already multiple groups camped around the lake in the spots that seemed available. And we want to try to be far enough away from others because we have kids with us. But um, this spot will work. The mosquitoes are coming out full force. Um, but we're trying to start getting the stove going. And got our pouches of food ready to go. And we have our bio. How's it working with the bug net? <laughs> you just have to start from a lower trajectory with the <laughs> spork. <laughs> and hope the mosquitoes don't come in with the food. <laughs> yeah. A little extra protein. So that was quite an experience a couple minutes ago. Jason and I were cleaning up from dinner and we heard Archie yelling, I gotta go poop, I gotta go poop. And we weren't close and there's all this marshland in between. So we just tried to do what we could do and get down to him. And by then, he'd whipped off his pants and just pooped in the middle of the grass. He had told us earlier before dinner that he had to go and he tried, but um, pooping in the outdoors is a learned trait, I think. So <laughs> we're all learning different skills on this trip. And uh, I'm learning it not so easy to wipe somebody else's bum either <laughs> so yeah that's that was our little adventure for tonight the uh dinner tonight we had was um mac and cheese with ham it was dehydrated i dehydrated all of it at home really good and had did not do a practice run on it so i had no idea how it would turn out and it actually turned out really well we learned it needed to be a little cheesier um Maybe using like Kraft brand would be better than using like Annie's, which is what we use. Um, there are a lot of mosquitoes. Sorry, I'm blowing them off my hand and everything. But um, anyways, so far things are going well. I think I'll hold it so I put it somewhere where nobody would probably see.